we're going to talk about touching off tools. There's been some tool, some talk about tool length offsets, and so we're going to employ this device here. This is going to be the new standard for the automation lab here at Dell Tech. Okay, so this is at a fixed height, and, and it works with a battery, and it will illuminate once the tool is actually touched off to the top. So let's go ahead and put this in action. Before we do, I want to notice you, know, you should notice some features about this. It's got a nice surface on the bottom here and especially this you can see here to where it's spring loaded okay that's very important because if we come down and hit a little hard on this it's not going to damage the tool or it's going to da or damage our setter so let's put this in so the first thing is we're going to make sure that the surface we're placing it on is clean and then likewise the bottom surface here is clean so we get a nice firm feel on the bottom it's not rocking it, it's solid okay that's where we want to be now the next thing is we're going to get into a couple modes here. First thing, we're going to hit our uh, jog handle, okay? And then what we're going to do is, is we're going to select uh, 100 thousandths and then select the Z, and we're going to bring this down. Now, we're going really fast, and we're not going to do this very long, okay? And then we're going to go back over to the control and go into 10 thousandths, okay? So you, know, you can see up here we're in 10 thousandths, and it's going to change how fast this thing is moving. This is much more comfortable for me. So I'm going to be jogging this down in ten thousandths, okay, until we get it to touch. Now it's touching and illuminated, all right? So at this point, I'm going to back up, and I am going to put this into tenths. You notice up here I'm in tenths, so I'm going to be moving much more fine. And now I can actually back it up. And you can see how it's the illumination is going away and I'm going to bring it down until I have solid illumination one click at a time solid illumination okay let's take a look at that from the operator standpoint if I am I am working this handle here I'm going up you can see the illumination go away down it's a little bit I got solid illumination right there one click at a time on tenths as soon as I'm done with that I go over here to tool offset measure well, let me back up. I need to make sure I'm in the right screen, so I'm going to go to offset, and this is my offset, and this is my length, my tool number, and then I will do the tool measure. Okay, it, it will update this. I just got done setting this tool, and you, as you can see, it's at exactly the same spot because I hit tool offset measure and it didn't change. So once I'm done with this, very simply, I can just kind of reverse the process. I can take the Z and back away and then you see my illumination goes away, turn it to 10 thousandths over here, and then I can rotate the handle and get my Z to get up out of the way. And at this point, I can go ahead and call up uh, my next tool, and I can set the next tool in the exact same manner I've set this one. Uh, and then this will allow us to go over and take one tool to set our G54 Z offset, and then all the tools will be uh, set for that particular offset, okay? New procedure.